hi guys welcome back to my channel today i have another fall video for you this is a simple look i know i've been doing simple looks lately and i know it's been a minute since i've done a youtube video but i'm back and if you want to know how i got this look please keep watching i'm going to start off by moisturizing my lips that way i won't have any difficulties putting on liquid lipstick then i'm going to be going in with the pore professional by benefit and i'm just um, basically filling in my pores with this this really helps um, minimize your pores I really like it if you haven't tried it I recommend it then I'm gonna be going in with another the pore professional matte rescue by benefit the only difference is is that it doesn't fill in your pores it's just a primer it helps oil control and I really like it then I'm gonna be mixing these two foundations the Too Faced Born This Way foundation and the L'Oreal um, infallible pro mac uh, foundation this is my favorite combo it basically makes my skin flawless and i'm blending this out with my damped beauty sponge for concealer i'm going in with the urban decay weightless naked concealer i'm doing the basically the same shade as my skin tone i'm not gonna go in lighter than i usually do because it is basically a simple look but if you want to go a little bit lighter i suggest doing it one shade lighter just because it is a simple look and it will look really really weird if you were to go all highlighted out with your concealer then I'm going to be going in with the NYX Highlight and Contour Palette and I'm using this shade right here to set my concealer. I did conceal my eyelids to prime for eyeshadow. To set the whole face, I'm using the Maybelline Fit Me Set Plus Smooth. And for contour, I'm going in with this Benefit Hula Bronzer with my Morphe E48 brush. This is a very good brush to contour because it really gets in there and it makes a good contour line. Then I'm going to um, bake underneath um, that contour line just to make my contour a little bit sharper and neater. Just leave this bakage for about a few minutes. I did fill in my eyebrows. If you want an eyebrow tutorial, I'll have the link down below. I'm taking this cool tone brown shade from the Maybelline Chai Latte palette and I'm using a big fluffy brush to blend this all over my crease. Then I'm going to be going in with Makeup Geeks Rapunzel. This is a beautiful color. It's not too matte and it's not too shimmery. It's like in between almost. And I'm just putting this all over my eyelid using my finger. I'm going to be coating in my eyelashes. I'm not going to go in with falsies, but if you want your eyelashes to be more va va voom, go ahead. I'm just wiping off the bakage right there. And as you can see, it makes the contour line a little more neater. Then I'm going to go in with Milani Bake Blush. Um, this is Luminoso. I know you guys see me constantly put this on, but I cannot put it down. It's such a beautiful I'm gonna blush. I'm going to go in with the Everlasting Liquid Lipstick by Kat Von D in the color Vampira. This is a very beautiful color. When you're doing seasonal looks. You don't have to be all so fancy with the eyeshadow. You could just put a bold lip and it will look super nice. Now that will complete my look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye everyone.